Steve Sanchez here in Piedmont Park. Let me just start by saying, if you want to see the most diversity of trees in one single location in the city of Atlanta, it's Piedmont Park. They have over a hundred species of trees here. And you can, it's, it's a perfect botanical garden for coming in and learning your trees. Case in point, today we're going to talk about bald cypress and dawn redwood. So bald cypress is so called because it drops its leaves in wintertime, which most conifers do not, hence it is bald. It is a tree that typically grows in swamps in its natural community. It's never found outside of wetlands, although it grows absolutely fine in the regular garden soil. You'll notice when you do plant bald cypress and you plant it in water, they will produce what's called knees, these protrusions that come up that somehow produce help to produce oxygen for the tree and help it to breathe. You'll, you will see knees in a typical lawn, but they typically won't be as big. But you can always mow them down if they get in the way. The tree will live up to a thousand years old. It's probably the longest lived tree in our eastern forest. And when it's in the water, it grows much slower than it is on land. It is in no hurry. It has a thousand year life. Uh, it's a beautiful tree in the fact that its bark is this fantastic orangey striated bark. It uh, has uh, also wonderful orange fall color. And I also want to introduce you to how to identify it from its very close relative, the Dawn Redwood. Dawn Redwood comes from Asia. It was actually <clears throat> thought to be extinct, but in 1945 they found it in a single valley in China and therefore uh, brought it some seed to America and we started growing it here. And the two are extremely similar in type of tree and, and their growth pattern, a, a pyramidal conifer uh, look. Now, uh, the way to tell them apart is the leaves of the bald cypress are smaller and arranged all over the branch, alternate, opposite, the leaves are just everywhere. Whereas you see on a dawn redwood, the leaves typically are opposite. This is one leaf, that's one leaf, and they come out opposite on a branch. And also you'll notice that the leaf is much larger <clears throat> than a bald cypress. So hopefully you'll never get the two confused. Even though Dawn Redwood can take some water, it is not as tolerant to water as bald cypress is. Now, if you want a fast growing tree, that is another reason to grow bald cypress. In normal lawn conditions, it will grow extremely fast and provide you a very nice light airy shade where you can grow azaleas and other things such as that underneath it that prefer a little bit of shade, but also prefer a little bit of sun to get their flower production up. So, Thinking of a good tree for the yard, bald cypress could be your candidate.